So, here we are. They're coming in at 50 pounds. Build quality is about what I expected. It's not your heaviest case. But the most important thing, it has good airflow. Well, yeah, good-ish airflow. I see already that these parts are filled in. I assumed from the picture they were just slightly darker bits, but... Uh, I guess not. And there's our tempered glass panel. Lovely. Let's uh, get a machine in this. Da, 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 da. Trusty screwdriver. Let's get this side panel off. Oh, in fact, these are thumb screws. Over tightened thumb screws. Definitely is glass, they weren't lying. Ah, oh, it's got plastic on both sides, excellent. Don't need to worry about fingerprints. Put that somewhere safe, put that in the box. Get in for now. We have one sheet of paper telling us how to build a PC. There you go, easy, now you can do it. Be nice if they'd have put mesh here as well. We've got a filter, then we've got another layer of metal with holes and then we've got this plastic with holes as well that don't actually line up to the previous holes so the airflow is not going to be you know as great as it could be however this is a pretty cool system um both literally and figuratively so it shouldn't matter too much but yeah that's not as airflow orientated as aero cool would have you believe right Pick up a bit of thermal paste from the uh, from that underneath. So let me give this a clean when we're finished. Yeah, so it's you know that's what you would expect from a fifty pound case. So here's all our front panel business. We've got I guess uh, yeah, we've got RGB. So this is the addressable RGB for the fans. SATA, power, front panel, USBs, USB 3. Cool. So, I'm going to put the fan on so I can do this without cooking myself. And we'll, I'll be back after the building montage and we'll have a look at what this thing looks like in its final form before performing some tests. Let's do this.
Okay, we are back. It's now the next day. Unfortunately, last night we had some technical difficulties. Both of my cameras died, so we didn't get the final parts of the build. However, I can now show you that the machine is fully set up and just waiting for an operating system. So today we're going to be installing Windows, unboxing those speakers and getting this machine up and running so we can run some benchmarks. My plan is to benchmark it against my PC. Uh, which is a GTX 1060 and a 2700X AMD CPU. So it should give us a pretty good basis for how far the technology has come, because essentially this build is a similar build. Uh, CPU slightly weaker, but more modern, so therefore stronger. I don't know, we'll figure it out. Uh, but either way, it should give us a nice point of comparison for people that are thinking about upgrading. And of course, right now, the most common upgrade is from the GTX 1060 to one of the more modern cards, so this will really give you an idea of whether or not you should be considering a 3060 if you're currently sitting on a 1060 or similar. So with that said, let's get this USB in the hole and get Windows on this bad boy.